will overshadow this week by the American number twos, Belvin and Agosto. Here they are then. Naomi Lang, Peter Chernichev in their fifth worlds. Skating to the Scorpions. Still loving you. Start. Right up to the moment and the crowd thanking them for that. Have they done enough to get back on top of the American pile?
not quite the response that the first Americans got, Tanith and Benjamin, but it's big. From the United States, mm, the emotion is setting in now. Powerful skate. It really was. They had to come out and respond, and respond they did. Again, a clean program. They couldn't have done it any better. Skated it with passion, skated from the heart. And uh, it was quite emotional. The last 30 seconds, the crowd getting right behind them. A well choreographed program designed to get the crowd right behind them. Well, there's some wonderful elements in there. Nikolai Morozov, their new coach, who choreographed the program. Sure, they'd have had a big input there. Yeah, they've created a style of their own, haven't they? Almost got a trademark. And he is such a distinctive figure. Let's look at this. Yeah, she's a powerful skater, but he, I think, is one of the best male skaters around. For me, the best is Sergei Saganovsky, who we've just seen, but he'd be up there for me. It's funny, isn't it? It's not just the skating, though. It's the, it's the whole look with yeah, him, isn't it? Charisma. He's a tall guy. Charisma, yeah. Real personality. And the chemistry between these two, I think, works so well. There's the power glide. We're sure can see that. Next up from Shailin Bourne and Victor Kratz, they are going to lead off the final group, which will come well, just under quarter of an hour's time. From the United States. Lovely picture. The now, have they done enough? Don't think so. I don't think so. No. no. Five three up to five point six. It's not to be. 